Faulkner side to look into what she perceives as an overwhelming number of recent crimes in Norfolk. From the mob attack near downtown to an attempted break-in at her home and others in Talbot Park, she insists police should do more. We looked into her complaint and found ways for people in any city to make their home safer. Police say Talbot Park is one of the safest neighborhoods in Norfolk. We checked and police reports show these streets are quiet. Nearly no crime in the last two months. But what about this? The house shook and it felt like somebody was trying to kick something in. That was just three nights ago. Heather and her family were inside and awake. They called 911. A neighbor saw three men running down the street. Police told 10 on your side there's no report for that because there was no evidence someone tried to break in. I just we just feel like it's unacceptable. Neighbors are concerned too. At 10 o'clock, I don't want to be anywhere else but inside my house. Someone tried to break into her house too. It says ADT on it, the alarm system and everything, and we, we actually do have it, and still they try to break in. During our interview in the backyard, they called for more police patrols. When we walked out front, how coincidental. How you doing? Coincidence or not, the officer explained he and his partner were on the block to pass out these pamphlets because of potential crime in the area. So we're just trying to re-educate people, make sure they're on the lookout. They stopped and talked to neighbors. To each individual person who lives in the neighborhood. If you see something that you know that's just not right, you need to get us out there. And they said you need to take a good look at what may make your home vulnerable. Police pointed out one big problem at this house, the high bushes. You could get all the way to the front door and never see someone hiding behind them. Police will walk with you around your home or business and show you what needs fixed. Well, and that's, that's really nice to hear. It may not stop all the crime, but neighbors and police agree it's a start. Now, the officers also said you can't expect to see more proactive and community policing like officers on bicycles in Norfolk neighborhoods. They say it's something the new city manager and new police chief are implementing.